Good afternoon, Messi Gang Gang. What's popping? What's happening? It's girl Drizzy. Welcome back to Drizzy Radio, a place where we talk about celebrity gossip, celebrity news, trending topics. If you're new here, kindly don't leave without subscribing. If you're a returning subscriber, I want to say special shout out to you. Anywho, without further ado, let's continue the mess of the day. Today's topic, we're going to talk a bit about Mr. Nasha Donna. Ah, oh, me! Mm-mm-mm. But anyway. So y'all know that a few weeks ago, Tanisha Donna left TZ where baby girl was literally turning hair. Like everybody was asking where she, where does she live? Who is she hanging out with? Where is she now? You know what I'm saying? Everybody's looking like <laughs> it's giving the Lulus <laughs> in Tanisha Donna's voice. But anyway, <clears throat> let me tell you what happened. So Tanisha Donna, right? Uh, she wrote some things on her Snapchat that got me feeling like is this girl throwing in some shade because she spoke a lot. Okay? She spoke a lot of things. And that reminds me, do you remember when Zuchu called out the baby mamas when she was going in on Diamond Platinum talking about the baby mamas? And we know for a fact Okay, we are speculating that is, I beg your button, pardon, that if she say that little on social media, there definitely a lot going on behind the scene. And I'm sure as soon as she touched on that, if baby mama or the baby mamas are close with anybody in the family might have asked, what does this Chiquita mean when she said that baby mamas are bringing their troubles to her or their stress? You know what I'm saying? Well, let's start with Anasha Donna began. She starts by saying, put your energy in things you have a future with. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> if you go, if you know, you know. She also continues saying, "We live in a Delulu world full of certified Delulus. No cap. Protect your peace and let the dog stay barking." Oof. Let me tell you something. I didn't know what Delulu is. Yes, like many of us on the comment section will not know what that is. I had to go and Google. Oh, yes. Yeah, so I had to go and Google the meaning of that. But first of all. She mentioned that the Lulu couple of times, and I'll tell you the meaning later on. She also continues saying, speak your mind, who care what you think? Do, do they butter your bread? Be an apologetic you with grace and, gla and class. Allah always work it out when your heart is clean, regardless of what they perceive of you, you guys. Tell me how you feel about it down in the comment section. And this is not where the cream de la cream is, okay? Let me read to you this long, long post. And then I'm going to tell you the meaning of that Delulu thingy that she meant. She said in a quote, you will seek your presence. They will, people will seek your presence but can't handle it. Honey! People will seek your presence but can't handle it. You will encounter people who are intimidated by your mind and presence. Anyone threatened by one's opinion, belief, outlook on life is in life. It's in real life a very negative thinker disguised in what they call toxic positive a lot of folks think they are positive by ignoring the reality which will ever have ups and downs because they because they are they are stuck in this false sense of positivity so they prefer to sweep reality under the carpet. She also continues to say, a positive thinker is not one who doesn't acknowledge the negative. Okay? That, like, ignoring social, political, world issues in the name of staying positive. A positive thinker will acknowledge the bad, find a solution, and not dwell in it. Not ignore it. She also continues saying... How is a problem solved if there is no problem? How are challenges accomplished without the challenge? The truth stings sometimes, but it's better to speak it. This is what we call toxic positive. You will encounter a lot of sensitive, weak-minded people who can't handle your mind, present, believes, and confident, yet they continue to seek it because their 
subconsciously deep down acknowledging what is authentic she also continues say what's the power of energy if you are weak minded and negative you will take this the wrong way if you are strong minded and positive you will grow from it i don't know it all i'm still learning but there is one i'm certain of is she also continues saying and when it comes to people and when it comes to people person believes wala wallahi speak your mind without this without disrespecting anyone speak it it someone is if someone is offended by it that's on them trust me it it has nothing to do with you there is a lot of wisdom in the court it's okay to agree to disagree especially when it gets to an extent where there's no mutual connection what okay <clears throat> baby girl was basically going on and on and on and on right i had to go and find out this delulus what or oh, what a slang okay i had it's a slang honey a slang okay as you can see there it's a short form of delusion okay delusion people who are living delusional people who are making their own reality even if it's not what it is happening but according to them that is what is going on in their mind basically that is what delusion means but anyway how you feel about it down in the comment section if you ask me i don't think tanasha donna will take her time and day to just go on and on and on and on talking about delusion people talking about this talking about that because remember when zuchu came out and basically talked about the baby mamas none of the baby mamas have replied or rather have seen them reply you know what i'm saying but this could be a reply or not somebody comment down below if you feel that this is a reply because you that people had a lot to say when Tanasha Donna was in TZ, you know what I'm saying? Clued, I heard some blogs saying that Tanasha Donna was taking child support to do uh, them surgeries. I'm like, did you all hear people saying that baby girl been about that life even before Diamond Platinums? I'm just saying, yo, like T was T even before D, Diamond. Anyway, tell me how you feel about it down in the comment section. Please don't forget to subscribe, share, like, and comment. Follow me on IG at Rizzi underscore radio. And of course, as always, keep it classy. Say messy. I love you to the moon and back. Bye-bye.